Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel. Today we are starting a new game in this Call of Duty series. I'm trying to play as many as I can before Black Ops 6 comes out. Um, we've just finished off Advanced Warfare and we're starting now on Call of Duty Infinite Warfare. This was a 2016 game as you can see on the screen, so it's, it's still a little bit older. Um, eight year old game, but I think in the last part of the Advanced Warfare playthrough, I I did say the wrong date for Black Ops 6. I was thinking about a different game. So Black Ops 6 is October 25th. For some reason I said September 6th, which is uh, another game I think I have uh, planned to play. Let me pull that up right quick. Um, no, sorry. Sometime in September, I got like four games to play in September. Uh, four big games to play, so I got a little wrong on that, but... Today we're starting the campaign of Call of Duty Infinite Warfare. I'm very excited. This is... We're starting on the games I've never played now. I haven't played Infinite Warfare. And I haven't played... Uh, what is that? World War II? The other Call of Duty game? Also, I haven't played any of the new series of Modern Warfare. I haven't played any of those new ones. And I'm gonna I'm gonna play a classic first and then get to the new ones. So I'm excited about that. And now uh, let's, let's dive right into the campaign. I was about to say, resume game. I haven't even started it yet. Okay. Start a new campaign. Here we go. Okay. Do not turn off power when the checkpoint res matches message appears. I'm stuttering already. We're going to go regular difficulty. Yeah. Stick with regular. What the heck is two difficulties worse than veteran? I might have to check those out. That'd be pretty interesting. Okay, dive right in. The needs of our planet were greater than she could supply. So we went beyond the reaches of our atmosphere. The new frontier offered the promise of a new beginning. But the distance gave way to a movement with no connection to the place we call home. New rules, new ambitions, a new enemy. The Settlement Defense Front built an army and broke away from the Earth with blood and violence. They aren't revolutionaries. They want absolute power. They raid colonies, take resources, and control territories by force. They use their fleet to block us from raw materials we need to survive. Their mission is to erase everything Earthborn. Today, the SDF is a war machine, ruled by its military. If a leader united that force, they would mobilize, try to take our homeland. Warlord, this is Scar-1, standing by for tasking. Copy, 1-1. One, one. one of our weapons facilities is under attack by the SDF. We believe this is part of an operation codenamed Raya. Intel suggests their target is a prototype weapon. Your team will extract the prototype and torch the site before SDF can locate it. Understood, Warlord. We'll get it done. One minute! Friendlies! Facility's dark. We'll get our weapon, torch the site. Gear check! OMA systems online. Rules of engagement. Weapons free. Ten seconds. Door! Green light's going. Green light. Call it, Wolf. Press A to Dude. jump. Let's dive right Dude. in this. Dude. Holy crap. Stay tight. I'm trying to stay next to you, but this is, uh... Boost! Boost! 
Yeah, I feel like it. Surface temps 300 below. Oh, oh these are some sick guns. Holy crap. Reaper, this guy's a boots on the ground. Oh, I like that. What do we got? Copy. On the move. FHR 40. I don't know what that is. And an NV4. Once again, this is... We're at... All, just all the way down? Holy crap. Okay. Like I said, this is one of the first games I have not played at all. All I know that they're... Okay, I'm not going to cut them off. I like going in these games blind. Oop, can't even use it. Yeah, I like going in these games blind. All I know is that there's like seven main missions and like six or so side missions. Sentries on the roof. Wolf, take one, we got the others. Oh, I got two, you got two. Push up. Mind the gap. Okay, you got a good jump boost. I feel like this is a common trope in uh, space, space age stuff. It's this common space age trope of uh, you advance past the earth and then all of a sudden people want to not be in control or under control of a planet that they're not living on. Oh, nice. I guess I'm opening the door. It's also an anti -graph. Copy that. What the what Damn. Okay, I'm I'm in it now too. Okay. Heat back up. My location. Watch your corners. Reaper, learn R and D. Moving to the armory. Copy. Be advised, SDF is almost inside. Operation Riot cannot succeed. Once the weapon is secure, I can activate the self-destruct sequence. Copy. Eyes on research lab. Contact. Where's contacts? Oh, right here. Keep us moving. Stay alert. We're not clear. Wait, that's just what the heck is this gun? Kendall forty four. Light him up. Why are you running at me? You have a gun. One, one, we're off the time and close to bingo fuel. What's your status? Move on target now. x on six marks. Out. Weapons on the other side. We beat them to it. Sights. Crash it. All clear. Jackpot. Got eyes on the ball. Rufo, we're inside the armory. Moving to secure the weapon. Copy one one. Weapon is in the vault. Once it's secure, I'll initiate the self-destruct sequence. Oh yeah. Put it up, Sipes. We're gonna need it. Get Wolf. Compact model. Same tech. The riot operation. We're after this. Oh nice. Reaper. Weapon secure. Confirming. I'm gonna keep the MV4. Roger. Initiating self-destruct sequence. Be advised, Setef has 50 plus infantry machines inbound. You need to get out of there now. Copy, we're asking why. RV in five. Clock's ticking. Let's move. I'm following your lead here. All personnel must clear the area. Holy crap.
Okay, I'm already out of ammo. That is very, very dangerous. Let's uh, recover some. Oh! I'm about to die here. This ain't good. Okay, let's please get out of here now. Let's go. Oh, that is... That is not good. Like John Snow. Gun destroyed. Data retrieved. Initiating trial. Wait, is that is that really? How many did you come with? Where? What about the airship we shot down? My men need medical. Be careful, your man. Okay, you just harmed a person for no reason. That is why you cannot win. This place... ...isn't yours anymore. Kill me. Save the bullet. Okay, so we got Jon Snow and Conor McGregor. Okay. Unclear. Helmet cam stopped transmitting. It's been 18 hours, no contact. Set def's made no demands. Settlement defense front doesn't make demands. They planted a flag in our rock. They executed three men and shot down a pilot. Our team was sent to secure classified weapons from a closed facility. That facility is a black site, Admiral. Why the hell is Set Def allowed in that airspace? By permission of the Accords, all nations have access to Sir, free... Sir, that objective required a full strike force, not a four-man team. Lieutenant Reyes, I implore you to use diplomacy in this office. Take a different tact. Yes, sir. Who else knows about this? Right now? Joint Strategic Air Command, 
and you. This is a deliberate act of aggression, Admiral. We should be out there on patrol, not down here throwing confetti. The rules of engagement prohibit definitive action under these circumstances. So we stand by with our barrels in the sand and we watch a Fleet Week parade? Lieutenant Reyes, make no mistake. My instincts, which are aligned indelibly with your own, are that we need to engage. Why don't we, sir? <sighs> They're politicians, Reyes. They'll wipe hell's ass with whatever flag keeps the smokestacks burning. To these men, the idea of mounting an offensive triggers a fresh and unplanned piss. Until there's war, the warriors aren't in charge. But, sir, by the time there's war, it's too late. Hesitation is a hole in the head. You drilled that into us relentlessly in flight school. Work the problem. Respond. You are always a fast learner, Lieutenant. STRATCOM is well aware of our grievances. At this time, no use of force is being considered on an operational level. These are the laws of war, son. Thank you for the briefing, sir. Admiral Reigns, E3N is in position on the roof. Thank you, Petty Officer. What is E3N? Go take a look for yourself. I think you'll be quite impressed. Dismissed. How many? Four. KIA. Europa? Front was already there. Took out the whole team. Looted the site. Son of a bitch. This full each stuff is nonsense. We should be up in our jackals flying watch. Admiral doesn't disagree. Captain Alderno? Negative. Today, retribution isn't a warship, it's a parade float. Whole fleet here in Geneva? Doesn't seem right. We do this every year, Saul. Well, let's not miss the party. After you, Lieutenant. Thanks, Slick. Come on. We'll take the scenic route. Memorial Hall, okay. Oh, yeah. Not a list you want to make. Peace to the fallen. Lest we forget. Crap. Yeah. Oh my god. Here a day, I prefer the wild black yonder. You and me both. Reigns mentioned a thing called E3N. Heard of it? Negative. Gray man's got all kinds of tricks up those four-star sleeves. He's flying to the ceremony with us. Make sure you don't call him that. Never. To his face. Make a hold. Right this way, lieutenants. Service has its perks. We got a plane to catch. This is ridiculous. Oh my god. Oh, that's crazy. Crowd's eating this thing up. Public relations, Reyes. Propaganda, Saul. We lost four men and we're going to party. Our hands are tied. Take a little R&R &R today, Reyes. That's an order. You can't give me an order. We're the same rank. You got me there, Lieutenant. Oh, this, this is the ship we're heading to? Ethan. Okay. I think we found E3N. Indeed, oh, sir. Okay, that's sick. The officer first class E3N and has tactical humanoid third revision. That's a mouthful. You ain't kidding. Call me Ethan, ma'am. What are your orders? I'm assigned to retribution, reporting to Captain Alder. Program for combat? Thoroughly, ma'am. Born to kill. You look like you can kick some serious ass. Well, now you're just making me blush, sir. Step aside, Ethan. This old goat can still fly. Welcome aboard, Admiral. Well. Now that we're all acquainted, let's get up and away. I like Ethan. Roger, Roger six. Roger, 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 six.
36. Vengeance is awaiting your arrival. Yeah, it's a very common trope of, uh, like I said, fiction where radar, don't want to be under moment. control of a planet you don't First live on anymore. Model. Quite remarkable. We're revealing him at the ceremony today. You know I get stage fright, right, sir? You got feelings, yeah. Ethan? I do. I like him. I do. I carry the brain of a human farmer. Holy shit, are you serious? No, ma'am. Not at all. <laughs> you got you, Lieutenant. Did not. Aegis guns are working overtime today, huh, Admiral? A lot of Allied traffic. Always vigilant, Lieutenant. You familiar with the air intercept systems, Ethan? Earth's Iron Shield. Major firepower. Vengeance, this is Raven 6. We're on final approach. Copy 6. Vengeance is awaiting your arrival. Admiral, sir. What is it, Ethan? The Aegis guns. They appear to be tracking our fleet. Incoming! Fight at the 